Hi guys, this is Mary. Today we're going to be talking about mini albums. They're really big right now. Everybody is into mini albums and you don't have to just go to the store anymore and pick up a 6x6 or an 8x8 to do a mini album. You can make them yourself with just a little bit of time, some chipboard, and some cardstock. Here is an accordion album I made just out of some cardstock. I cut the uh, little embelly on the front out of mini monograms and I put an M for Mary and the paper's die cuts with the view and all I did was take some cardstock I had intended to make a card and I went ahead and scored and folded it and then I thought well I'd kind of like to make an album so I just started uh, turning them over and gluing them and kept going until I had a little mini album but this one I put some pockets in there and it's a little heritage album so I have some pictures of my sister and myself when we were really young. Here's my mom and dad and me. And I put lots of little embellishments and some little sentiments on each page. Here's some more of my sister and myself. And you can make this just keep going. You know, it'll get thicker, of course, but just make it as uh, small or as big as you want and uh, make your little pockets and I cut the little scallop out of this one with my uh, circle punch I just cut it halfway then I came to the back and I thought well I still have the back side too so I started working on it I still have two more pages to go I've got to find some more pictures for these but I'm going to be doing a series of videos on mini albums and this will be one that I'll be showing you here's another one I really love this one this one's been called an accordion album, a squash book, and a concertina, and an accordion card. I don't know what you call it, but I just think it's the cutest thing. You've probably seen these, but I made the, this a couple of years ago, and it's got lots of Halloween pictures and little poems and things, and I just had the best time making this. I don't know if you can see how it folds up but I'll be showing you how to make this one also. And it just folds back up on itself and you just tie it back together. Very cute little album. And of course I did a video already showing y'all how to do the toilet paper roll mini tag album using the Cricut to make your little tags. This is one I made for my puppy Sophie and I just took some chipboard. I wanted a 7x7 seven seven, so I cut it 7x7 seven seven, and I covered it inside and out and decorated the front. Punched holes with my crocodile and set some eyelets and used little binder rings to make a little three ring album. And there's my little Sophie when she was just a little bitty puppy. I've got to take some more pictures of her though. I don't have enough in here. These are all when she was younger and she's two and a half now. So I'm kind of behind. There she is. This was on her first birthday. Of course I had to do that. There's a picture of her. She's laying on the back of the sofa waiting for her daddy to come home. Also decorated the back. This is a very simple one and we'll be learning how to do that one. Here's a really neat little mini album which also uh, will help you with recycling like the toilet paper roll album. This one is made from the return envelopes that they stick in junk mail all the time. You know when they're trying to get you to take a credit card and they'll stick the envelopes in. Well I've started uh, doing the inside of it but you can see right here or I hope you can I just sealed the envelope shut. Now you don't have to, you can leave it open if you want to use these like pockets and just tuck the flap of the envelope inside, but I just wanted flat pages. And then you just decorate them however you want and put in your pictures and your sentiments, whatever you want to do. That's a really inexpensive little album to make, costs practically nothing. We'll be doing that one. And the last one, this is another little tag album. And this just uses a piece of cardstock that you cut in half. And when you fold it over, it makes a little pocket. And then you make your little tags and put inside. And then you fold it back on itself. 
tie it up. That's another cute little outfit. And we'll also be doing that one. So just keep that in mind. I'm going to be uh, trying to start getting these videos on next week. And uh, we'll be doing lots of mini albums together. So thanks for stopping by and taking a peek. And I'll be back with you soon with a new video. Bye.